was uh, right in this area. It, there's, a, there's a picture down at the Crystal Palace uh, that's right in front of that fireplace right there of uh, President Reagan and Buck. And that's not the only memory made between Owens and Reagan. They even sang a duet together in the backyard in 1968. President Reagan told Buck that before he became an actor, he wanted to be a singer. Well, Buck went and grabbed a guitar, and they did an impromptu duet on Buck's big song, Act Naturally, right about right here. Buck's sons also had fond memories here with their dad, something nobody ever knew. A lot of people, when they see this property, they think that Buck might have parked his tour bus in between dates out here or back there, even in that garage. Instead, he would play basketball with his sons in that garage. His son's buddy, Michael, told me there was never a tour bus here. They used that back garage to play basketball in, and both Buddy and Michael chuckled the other day when I called them, and uh, they mentioned that Buck was a pretty tough basketball player. And though they no longer live in this house, the memories of Buck, his music, and his family will continue to live on throughout these halls. Buck is one of the top five country music artists of all time. I've been winning that discussion for 30 years with my arm tied behind my back. And uh, this is one of the places that he lived and made hit records, and it's, uh, it's really a great property. The house is being sold through Miramar International Realtor Shelly Murphy. You can contact her at 661-333-1467. For the now, Vanessa Romo, 23ABC.